Hello guys, what is up, it's Mace. Welcome back to Blazed and Glazed. I am so mother oven excited about today's video. We're gonna be getting into some closet decluttering. We're gonna be getting into some thrifting, of course. And I am going to be announcing my three month partnership that is kicking off today with the Whatnot app. I am so stoked to introduce you guys to Whatnot. Maybe some of you guys have been using it already, but they are a live shopping platform that works kind of like in an auction style. And I personally have been looking for like a secondhand platform to partner with for a really long time. But I I wanted to partner with one that would allow me and support me in giving back to the community. So over the next three months, I'm gonna be doing four different live streams with them. All of the profits from every single live stream that I get for selling you guys my fabulous thrift finds and clothes are all gonna be donated to different charities and organizations. I will pop up the first one right here that is gonna be getting all the profits from my first sale, which is happening this Wednesday at 4 p.m. PST. Beauty to the Streets, she aids those experiencing homelessness here in Los Angeles, which is obviously a huge and massive problem. And it's also extremely hot outside especially here in LA so she does a lot with getting them water and food and making them up and getting them clothing and anything that they need to feel good and like live a better life and survive out here in this LA heat so I will have the link down below in the description box that you guys can go and use to download the app and get $10 in credit towards your first purchase like I said I'm gonna be doing some closet decluttering in this video and thrifting and all of the pieces that you guys see in this video that I pull out of my closet that we find at the thrift store together are going to be in the sale on Wednesday. So download the app using that link down below. Follow my page on Whatnot so you guys can get like notified when the sale is happening. But I have a couple of pieces, you know, for preview that you guys can go check out on my Whatnot. Download the link. Let's get into some fun stuff. I want to show you guys some of the clothes that I've pulled out of my closet that are going to be in the sale on Wednesday. These are all pieces that I have loved near and dear to my heart that either don't fit me anymore or just like have had their moment with me and I'm ready to give them to one of you guys. So, oh my God. And I forgot literally the best part of this partnership, the reason reason I said yes, 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 is because not only am I going to be giving the profits away from every single stream, but out of the four streams that I do over the next three months with whatnot, they have agreed to match all of the profits that I make off one of the streams. So I'll be sure to let you guys know in the future, which stream that's going to be. So we can like really get, you know, the things selling so we can get some money out to people and help, you know, make this world a better mother effing place. Okay, now for the clothes. Obviously, as you can see, I have not gotten ready for the day yet. I am in my, you know, fabulous little pajamas, but we are going thrifting in a little bit. Let's run through some of these items. I can't even believe I'm partying with some of these, but this little micro midi skirt does not fit me anymore. It's by Lip Service. It's so cute and fabulous. If you guys know freaking Lip Service, you know how hot and fabulous this is. And I don't know if I said this before, but since it's kind of like an auction bid style, I'm gonna be starting like the price for all of these items at just $1. So some of these could go for literally a dollar. I'm also gonna be doing a giveaway on the stream. So make sure you are there. Make sure you are there, don't be square. Come shimmy with me, live style. Okay. Okay, lip service mini skirt, it's gonna be there. These amazing Eddie Bauer jean cutoff shorts. These are fabulous, but again, don't fit me because I've gained weight this year. And what do I always say? We do not shrink ourselves back into the clothes that we do not fit anymore. You know, we just thrift more fabulous clothes and pass the old clothes on to the next. Uh, oh my God, these pants, my little like wine glass martini pants. Oh, so fabulous. Let's see, let's see. Oh, these jeans. These are by the brand Angels and they're just like amazing Y2K split crack booty, you know, just the way I like it pants we have this fabulous little like rose skirt oh my god this matching set guys oh so good it's by the brand mia fashion and it's literally this matching skirt and top it's just giving me very like melissa joan hart's three to the teenage witch energy we have this denim skirt there's gonna be so much stuff in this live guys and like i said we're about to go thrifting to get more because i did ask you guys on my instagram at my Lenny what items you wanted to see from me in this live so i'm gonna go pick up a couple of things i have this little like very britney murphy uptown girls little like shrug moment little bedazzled shrug moment oh my gosh this like vintage kind of like corset top it's stunning i also am gonna have the p is for pampered bag that i just picked up in palm springs recently um, what else, what else? Oh my gosh, there's so much fun stuff. Okay, this skirt that never fit me, but I found it from an estate sale and I just knew eventually it had to go to one of you guys. Look at like the fairy bottom. This is definitely in a bigger size and I definitely will have pieces that are in a bigger size than just small medium. This Playboy corset, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? It's so, so hot. So that's some of the stuff. We're gonna go thrifting. I'm gonna keep cleaning out the closet. I'm gonna take you guys in the closet with me. And oh, I'm so excited for this live stream. 
and to be working with Whatnot. They're fabulous. So thank you, Whatnot, for sponsoring this video. Now, <laughs> I look like I had a toupee. Now, let's go. Should we clean the closet out first or go thrifting first? Clean the closet out first or go thrifting first? I think we unfortunately should probably clean the closet out first. Let's get into a little bit more of that. You guys, it's a mess. Okay, so for you guys that are new, this is my closet. Um, hold on, it's this entire section right here. And then this like double decker situation right here. Let's just ignore all of this. <laughs> this is like a lot of um, stuff I've already pulled out and donations for people experiencing homelessness that I'm taking over to a friend that's gonna take them to the shelter. And then I have like my shoes and bags over there. But this rack is the one that I really wanna focus on today. I just feel like when a rack is starting to look this schmuck, mushed together. I probably need to remove some things. <sighs> I've already combed through it once and I pulled out a bunch of stuff that's in this basket that's going to be in the whatnot sale but this rack has like kind of like my party tops, my shimmy shake tops, my skirts, and my dresses. What can we pull out of here? Let's challenge ourselves um, and see what we can pull out. <laughs> Okay, what do I like actually not wear? See, I have like things like this little blue dress that I thrifted in New York like last year and I never got a chance to wear it. I think I'm just gonna leave this at the front here because I do wanna wear it before I get rid of it. Let's see what else. Uh, this dress I've always held on to because I think it's so cool. I obviously got in the lingerie department. It has like cutouts all down the sides, but it's just a little short for me. So maybe I'll put this in the sale. Oh, this meow dress that I also literally... Okay, I'm pulling the trigger and I'm getting rid of this meow dress. This is just like, I love the brand meow and I love this dress. I got it secondhand on thread up, but again, I haven't worn it since I got it maybe two years ago. And I think I have to part with it. I don't know. This is going in the maybe pile as well. Hmm. I've been so into dresses lately. It's like hard for me to part with any. I do have this one. Cadillac butterfly. I don't know. But it's like this really long dress. Let's see how this looks on, honestly. Because I've been fully in my dresses era recently. I've never been a dress girl. Wait, this is kind of amazing. Like the dress is kind of gorge. What do we think? Do I need to keep this and like try it out? Maybe I will. Maybe I will like literally force myself to wear this in the next month. <laughs> and then after I do, I'll put it in one of the whatnot sales that's gonna be in September or October because this is gorge and deserves a couple different lives. So. Okay, let's change back into the fit. Let's change back into um, our t-shirt. Okay, let's see what we got in the skirts. I love this skirt. This one, I feel as if I cannot be sure. I love this white one. I love this one. I love this one. I love this one. I love this one. Ugh, do I just get rid of this Tommy Hilfiger Maxi? I've had this denim Tommy Hilfiger Maxi for a couple months now. It has this like amazing slit, like almost all the way up to the crotchety crotch, but it's gorgeous. Ugh, again, I feel like this is something I'm gonna pull out and put in the front of my closet wear it and then put it in one of the next whatnot sales so hopefully this has you guys enticed to uh come to the all of the sales okay this is where i need to like get some shit out we need to get rid of this shimmy shake top i love it so much it's sheer and black and has pink embezzlements all over it embezzlements embellishments <laughs> all over it okay we're getting rid of that slay love all of these love all of these love this love this love this uh uh i love this love god it's so hard for me to get rid of. okay okay i'm getting rid of this i never wear this it's like very like versace like 90s versace vibes it's just like a animal print shimmy shake that doesn't button all the way we gotta get rid of that we gotta get rid of it because i have other animal print ones like this one that i love and wear so much more my poochie ones oh i love this one i love this one okay now the party tops guys the party tops for a girl that doesn't party too much, she has a lot of party tops. But honestly, like, life is a party. Rock your body. Let's see what's in here. See, guys, this is, like, really a mess. Okay, this is a tube top I got recently, so I'm keeping that. I love this, like, Aerosmith tube top. This Catherine Melandrino top. Oh, this top that my friend literally made because she is an icon. This. I'm getting rid of this. 
I really hope I don't regret getting rid of this. It's so great. I got it in a state sale like two years ago. It's very Carrie Bradshaw, but I've had my looks with it. So it's going in the sale pile. I'll organize that later. And then all of my black party tops that all look the same, but totally different. Okay, I'm gonna challenge myself to pull at least two out of here. Two, one, I don't know. You guys will see in the sale. And then this is my coat rack, which is really hard for me to purge anything off of because I love it so much, but maybe I'll get rid of this. This is like something that's, okay, I'm gonna get rid of this for sure. This little like suede vest. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's like suede, it has buckles, it has like some fur on the sides. This is really great, but I'm not gonna pull for it this year. I just know it. So one of you guys can rock it. Let's see what else. I love that, I love that. Oh, I'm never getting rid of that. Fabulous, yas, hmm. Hmm, this is where it's getting tricky. Tricky, tricky. I feel, okay, I'm gonna get rid of this because I never pull for it, even though I love it. It's like kind of like utility vibes. It's giving like old gap. It's giving Zoolander to me. Like I feel like Derek Zoolander would wear this. So if you also relate to Derek Zoolander like I do, maybe you should pick it up in my sale. Okay, I'll add this for sure. Because as the sales go on, you guys, I'm doing one in August, one in September, and two in October. I wanna be able to get you guys more like fall, winter vibe stuff. So maybe I'll like save the coats for the September, August sales and keep like the dresses and the tiny tops and the shorts and the skirts and all of that in this August one. So maybe we'll do some more coat combing through in the next video, but also let me know if you guys want to see like vintage t-shirts vintage sweatshirts this is where i keep all of my vintage t-shirts beautifully organized but i could definitely go through these and pull out a couple for you guys i feel happy with where we're at right now honestly could pull more pants out because like i said earlier in this video i've gained weight over the past like two years and some of these pants like these pink planet funk snakeskin pants don't fit me anymore and I don't intend on shrinking myself down to fit them again anytime soon. So I'm glad I got my little booty in there at one point, but they might need to go to a new home. So, oof, these are, oof, I don't know. These are beautiful. These are beautiful. These I will, I will part with. I, oh my God, guys. Okay, I think these are also Planet Funk. Paris Blues. These, these pants. Oh my God. Am I gonna be crazy and get rid of these pants? I don't know, you guys will have to see in the whatnot sale. Okay, I also have more mini skirts that I'm gonna be getting rid of as time goes on because, again, too small for my booty, but... Ah, okay, that is all we're gonna do for today. I think I'm gonna comb out the closet a little bit more, but I'm excited to go thrifting for you guys. We're gonna do that tomorrow, I decided, so... Check back in for the thrift tomorrow. Peace queens. Okay, now that we have cleaned and I've pulled out a ton of shit to get rid of and give to new homes, AKA you guys, we're gonna go hit the thrift. I have so much fall thrift on the brain, so I'm gonna be like doing a little, you know, peeping on the fall thrifting. I'll pop up some kind of like vibes that I'm feeling for like pre-early fall. I'm going to New York in September, so you know, we're already planning. Plus, I'm obviously gonna be thrifting for you guys, so definitely leave in the comments any like specific kinds of items that you guys really, really wanna see in the next live, which will be next month. Let me know what you guys wanna see, but for now, we're gonna go hit the thrift. We're gonna go hit the thrift. We're gonna go hit the thrift. I live in a sea of clothes and I wouldn't have it any other way. Okay, update from the thrift. Things are spicy. Some of this, I will admit, a couple pieces are for me, but most of it's for you guys. The music is so loud in here, but this is everything we're getting. Some of this is for Tyler. Also, you guys, I this is gonna be for a whole separate conversation, but Tyler found me all of this vegetable kitchenware that I have been wanting and trying to thrift manifest for months, for years. I've been talking about wanting like Ages, vegetable, eh? like things like that and I just knew they would come to me at the thrift and they, today was the day. Okay, you can give me credit, I'll take it. Today was the day, sorry those guys, those will not be in the whatnot sale, but the clothes will be. Okay guys, this little Goodwill right here, we drove literally 45 minutes to get to her and she I smacks. It's, I think it's the epitome of oh hot damn, this is my jam. Keep me party until the AM. I don't think they'll let us do that though because it's Goodwill, but. Y'all don't understand. Let me throw my hands in the air, 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 air. <laughs> that was so intense and unhinged. 
That was like the best thrift in a minute. And I thought the Palm Springs thrifting last week was good. I can't believe you found me that vegetable stuff. Like how much did your heart? Well, wait. What's your first reaction to finding those? Like, you know how long I've been on the Okay, hunt. you know what my reaction was. I didn't have a car, I had an armful of clothes, and I literally grabbed as many as I could hold that looked like the most prized ones, and I ran over to the specialist. I could have said, Macy, look. Like, like the cauliflower? And you said, get a cart. Is you hadn't even seen the asparagus yes. and the leeks yet. No, I saw that. I just didn't know those would be as, you know, hot of a ticket item. I just don't think you guys understand knew. because it's not something I've talked about as much in my videos because you know I feel you guys are here for the sexy Y2K vibes and the hot clothes and the sexy sexy yes yes I don't even know what I'm saying but just you guys are here for the fashion usually just, maybe just, a nice home decor moment but I didn't know anyone was like truly here to know about my vegetable kitchen ceramic fetish. obsession fetish if you will I've been on the hunt for literally like a stick of butter that like <laughs> is a butter holder but like it looks like a stick of butter and so like were you like holy shit I just knew Balls. any moment I get the moment to make you very happy and surprised with a find like that is just a good day so I was very excited oh it's so hot so where else should we go? Well, <laughs> you said you wanted to hit at least 27 well, that, places. We right? don't need to do that because that was iconic. Just kidding. But yeah, you said you wanted to go a, a couple places. Can we just go to that other Goodwill that I like? Actually, yeah, why don't we plug in on the GPS before I'm, I start driving? Yeah, one sec. Next stop of the day. Oh, there's like no one in this parking lot. It's perfect. Okay, you guys are lucking out because I have found amazing stuff. I did not intend for this Goodwill to be as good, but it is. Okay, let me show you guys some of this stuff. This like insane little cardigan, it's giving very generic energy. This little set, really just for the shorts, but I think I should leave this behind. I'm sorry if any of you really love it. This is like the kind of thing I love to just look at at the thrift store. It's like a jazzercise jacket, but it has like fur and it's cute. And like, this is hard for me to leave. This is definitely gonna be in the live. It's like Sheeran has a little tank top underneath. These, <laughs> I think we're just gonna go no with these. Oh my God, these pants are insane. And I actually used to have these in denim. Do you remember when I had these in denim? Yeah. It was the same exact pair. Here's the tag. But these actually look like they might fit me. I got too big for the other one. So this works for me, I think. Okay, then I found this vest. Oh my God, look at that cute boy behind it. This vest that will be perfect to like be a top. I found you guys these two skirts. Look at the movement on it. This one too. These ones are going in the live. These ones are for you guys. Okay, these two pieces are so outside of like my kind of vibe right now, like personal style wise, but they're like also two pieces I feel like I just want to have in my collection. <sighs> okay guys, the verdict is that this one is not the vibe. Then there's this. Look at this. I know, I know. I mean, it could be cool. It could be cool to like challenge myself to style. And also, you know, give me, hit me with it. I mean, I like the shoulders. I do too. It you. It's hard to tell with like the camera shoulders. What do we think? Okay, this dress I'm super excited about. Oh, I don't know what the size is, but maybe like, an XL. It just has like the most gorgeous detailing. It's got like this great 90s tag, the blue zebra print. Okay, we've moved. I love this brand. I love finding this at the thrift. I found pieces by them at the last one. I don't know if I should get this or not. I think I'm gonna leave it. This is definitely going in the live. I literally thought it was gonna be like too good to be true fast fashion. It's like paper, it's so good. I literally thought there's no way this isn't Sheen um, when I saw it from afar, but it's not. And then, just two more vests for tops. A lot of you guys said you wanted vests for tops, so. That's the vibe. Oh my God, look what Tyler found. Yeah. On top of finding grapes. He found this, which is gonna look so sick in our living room. Okay, I need to reorganize this. <laughs> oh, the colors are giving me life. This is giving me very much so fall. Okay, last minute find, guys. Made in France. 
Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna like style this for you. That, 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 that's incredible. Okay, last minute I had to grab this skirt. It's so cute. And green tags are half off today, so. Okay, so it's the day after thrifting. I'm honestly still like so shook by the amazing stuff that we found, especially my veggie children. I just washed them all and filmed a TikTok. I gotta say, this baby is my favorite. The cauliflower napkin holder. She's a star. And honorable mention to the avocado with the spoon as the stem. Anyway, back to the clothes. I got everything for the whatnot sale washed up for you guys. Let me show you. I hung everything up in this kind of like extra haul closet that we have, but this is a bunch of the stuff. Stuff, including some of the stuff that we bought at the thrift yesterday that I've washed some slip dresses I pulled and didn't get a chance to show you guys yet from the closet clean out the other day but these are literally all pieces that are gonna be in my whatnot lives so I'm so excited and then obviously all the bottoms that were in that one basket I showed you guys earlier anyway I don't know why my eyes are watering like damn fools but I am so excited for this first whatnot live I hope you guys are too remember to click that link down below Below to download whatnot and to get the $10 credit towards the live obviously you could literally get an item for free multiple items for free who knows how the bidding is gonna go but like I said earlier in the video I'm going to have every item starting at just $1 so ah, okay I'm so excited to get to hang out with you guys there I love you guys so much do not forget that you are a beautiful ass queen no matter what doing your thing just the way you do again shout out whatnot for being the fabulous sponsor of today's video and yes you guys are fabulous. You're amazing. Okay, that is that. I will see you Wednesday. Peace, queens. Peace. Peace, love, and shimmies. Oh, so many shimmies. Extra shimmies for you from me.